Hi everybody, we're back with another video. We're going to look at our ball and wall series again. So this time we're going to be looking at first touch. Now, first touch to a lot of people means those that can stop it dead first time. Looks nice, looks pretty, but the better players can control the ball first touch into directions. So they can control the ball where they want it to go and keep the ball moving. That's the important point. They keep the ball moving all the time. Ideally, we want you to try and do that first time. It's not a case of taking a touch and then doing it. Sometimes that might have to happen, but we want you to get used to taking this with your first touch. So we're going to today practice a little pass off our board and then a first time touch into space and a shot at the end. So we've got our bounce board. We've got a goal. We've obviously got our balls. Now you could do this in your garden with a small goal and a board. It doesn't matter. I'm working on a big goal today, but you could do it at home easily or get to the park and do it in a goal. Right, let's get into okay. it. So the challenge is this. We do one pass off the board. The next touch has got to be a touch past the board. That's important, it's got to go past the board. Your third touch is gonna to be the shot at the end. It's the, it's the middle one that I'm interested in. It's the touch after it's come off the board where you go past it to shoot, okay? So that's the challenge. Off the board, one touch into space and shoot. The rules are simple. You must keep the ball moving and it must go past the board. That is it. I want you to try 10 each side. 10 with your right foot, 10 with your left foot. Let's have a look. And that's the challenge guys, a simple one, but these ball and wall drills always are, but they're so effective. If you don't have anyone to play with at home and you want to do some individual work, these are the great things to try. Now, like you'll see, mix it up with the parts of the foot that you're using. That's why it's great to go off the board because you have to react to where that bounce comes back. If you notice on my left side, I had to use the outside of my foot a little bit more. That's the idea with this. Do whatever comes naturally when the ball comes to you. So you're going to be using lots of different parts of your feet with this one. You'll see as well on my left side, the last one, a little bit dubious. It just went past the board. So I've got to think about how hard am I hitting it with my first touch? What's the distance? Am I making a run too quick afterwards? These sorts of things. So there's loads going on with a very, very simple drill. Try to do 10 each side. If you fail, you've got to start again. So you might do one, two, three. You're fourth, you don't really have a good touch or you, you, you don't score. You've got to start again until you get 10 in a row on your right foot, 10 in a row on your left foot. Give it a try. We'll see you again soon.